Hey guys, what's up? It's Bree. Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be putting on this beautiful, beautiful unit. This unit is from You Nice Hair. And we're going to go ahead and put it on. First of all, let me hurry up and put it on. Because girl, I'm on here with my little peanut head. Um, this is a really, really nice unit. I want to show you guys how the inside looks. So with this unit, I did bleach the knots a little bit. Because I feel like they wasn't bleached enough for me. Now they did come pre pre-bleach but I still went and bleached them I'm just using my tint tint temptation um lace milk um lace tinting spray in medium brown I love using this on my laces now this wig did come pre-plucked pre-cut and it also came with two of these little side tapes on the inside of the wig to help hold your unit down i took the tape out i'm not really a big fan of the tape but if you like the tape you could definitely um wear the tape so we're gonna go ahead and put this unit on it comes with a comb in the back and i love when a unit comes with a comb in the back look at that <laughs> Ooh, i love the way that looks so good now with this unit i did pluck it a little bit because the hairline was a little too um you know too bulky for me so i did go ahead and pluck it a little bit not a lot but just a little bit you can just customize the unit to what you like guys i always say that although the companies are making it a lot easier for us you still have to customize it just to make it you know work for you so um this is how the unit look <clears throat> and like i said it does come with two tape pieces of tape on the side so when you get your box it's gonna look like this you open it up it comes with a little satin bag like this you're also gonna get some nails and an hd stocking cap and also an edge band which i love you're gonna get a um elastic band to go inside of your wig to make your wig a lot more snug if you wanted to wear it um glueless or anything like that and you're also going to get a beautiful 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 robe i love you nice robes they are so cute i have so many let's go ahead and put it on it's a really pretty girly robe i love it i really use the robes i love robes so this is just so pretty i could do my makeup with it i could be on tiktok with my cute little robe i love the robes um that's a nice little touch that you nice always send over okay so we're gonna go ahead and use the red by kiss ultimate whole spray i love love this stuff you guys i actually like this one better than the even one that i used to be super in love i like this one better and also i'm going to be using the home dial adhesive i'm going to put mm, two layers of this and one layer of this on so yeah let's go ahead and put this unit on we're going to go ahead and pull the unit back a little bit and we're going to right wipe around the hairline because we don't want any makeup on the hairline because I don't want to break out sometimes if I keep makeup on my hairline by mistake my face will definitely break out and I don't want that to happen so you want to make sure that you really really clean your hairline and also it makes your wig last a lot longer so all I do is just take a little alcohol and clean my forehead and we're gonna go ahead and apply this unit and you guys can go ahead and enjoy this beautiful jazz music and let's go ahead and put her on
Okay, so now that this unit is on, pretty much on, and it look a little white around the hairline, but we'll fix that later, you guys. I'm going to just take a little bit of the even um, melting spray. And I like to put this on the lace part. I don't like to use it like this spray. I like to use it on the lace part to help melt the lace down a little bit more. And I don't spray it directly on the hair. I like just take it and put it on the lace area like so. Push everything back, making sure everything looks as neat as possible. Now I'm going to go ahead and take a little bit of my even lace mousse. So I still love using my lace products, my even products, but that second layer, I like to just use, when I'm gluing the hair down, I like to use the red, the um, the style fix fixer. I don't know why, it just, I feel like it works a little stronger. So I still feel like I'm gonna have to pluck this unit some more to make it look a little bit more natural for me. You know, I feel like it looks too boxy right here. So I'll probably just go back and pluck it a little bit more. I always just go over it. Okay, so let's tie it down for a little bit. And then I'm going to just go ahead and blow dry it while it's tied down. Always tie it in a knot just so it can be super, super tight. And then I just pull it up a little bit. All right, so. We're gonna go ahead and blow dry it and make it really dry. Okay guys, so I just took my hair band off and the lace is pretty much down. Now I'm gonna do a little bit more plucking. Like I told y'all, I have to pluck more of my hairline just so it can look as natural on me as possible. I like my hairline to look super thin just because it mimicked my natural hair. So I'm just gonna Plug a little bit more up in this area. That's just cause that's just what I like. And this is how I customize my units. Cause a lot of people say, Brie, how do you get your units? So girl, I do it to fit my face. I know on the side, I like my hairline to look a little bit more on a thinner side right up in here. So I kind of know what I like. Yeah. So I do that. I have a fresh tweezer, so baby, it's not clean. Okay guys, so I think that's enough plucking for right now. Now I may go and pluck more later, but right now this is how the unit look after I like pluck it some. Um, sometimes I just like go and pluck it more until I get it exactly how I like it. What we're going to do now guys, we're going to go ahead. You see this little white cast right here? This is a small little white cast. I'm going to take a little of my bronzer. I used to use my foundation color, but I noticed I like it better using like a darker color. Um, just one shade darker or two shades darker than me. Not too dark. Just because I wear makeup. So when I put my bronzer around and my contour around my hairline, it kind of melts in. So it's just i don't know i just like using this this because it's not too thick it's not too heavy you see how that just melts to the hairline oh my gosh and that's what i use 
and this is the soul on on instagram i'm sure it's a popular brand but this is what i like to use because it's a matte finish and it just makes my hairline look really really good and it doesn't oxidize too red because sometimes when you use certain type of makeup when the sun hit it it's start to oxidize a little red and this one don't really oxidize so you see how that looks look like it's just coming from my scalp and that's what I like and sometimes I just add it up on the hair part as well and that's how I like get my hairline exactly how I want it so I can style my hair exactly how I want it I don't have to stick to wearing my hair in certain ways because I plucked it this way I always pluck my hair first and then I style my hair the little thing right there that's just something that I do I pay close attention to you know people natural hair and I just like it to be a little thin right there so you see how that look you see how that look oh y'all see how that look oh my god okay you nice hair so we are gonna add some cute little curls gonna do a little flip over um, of course, y'all know I'm going to do a flip over <laughs> because what else do I do? Um, and this hair is pretty, let me show y'all. It has a pretty nice length on it. So, yeah. I'm going to find my little, my little, well, first I think I'm going to add some curls and then I'm going to cut the layers in it. Take a little bit of the Miracle Glossy Leave-In. Put that on the hair comb through it nicely oh my gosh this color is like one of my favorite colors to wear like I'm not really a color girl I love like really jet black hair but when I do wear my color it has to look like this the way they dyed this is so pretty oh my gosh I know I want to keep I'm gonna keep this wig on for a few weeks Hey guys, so I'm in the bathroom and I'm just curling my hair. I don't know why, but when I'm in the bathroom, I can like see, see everything when it comes to curling and cutting layers. I guess because the mirror is so big. So that's what we do. We just curling our hair in some like messy curls right now. And then I'm going to cut my layers. But nothing has to be like perfect right now. We just giving the hair a little bit of shape. Like, I like to do my lace <laughs> in the mirror mirror, and then I like to do my hair in the bathroom, okay? So my camera went dead and it did something while I was recording. But I did go ahead and cut the hair in like some light layers. So I'm going to be using this Wow Style on Steroids. I saw this on TikTok. This is going to give my hair a lot of volume. Now this is very strong hairspray. So I don't want to put it on the bottom of my hair. I kind of want to just put it on the roots of my hair. Because this is very um, a stronger hairspray. So I'm just gonna do it like that. <clears throat> but it's very, very strong, y'all. Like, you don't wanna put it all over the hair cause baby. Now, I can curl this a little tighter if I want to, but I don't like my curls to be too tight. And that is it. 
it don't look dry it looks so luxurious so yeah really really cute so talk to you guys so talk to you guys in my next video let me just give you guys how it looks from the back <laughs> yeah so yeah bye guys